rows and columns are one of the main part of Excel software, whether it is the 2010 version or it's the 2019 version. Without rows and columns, there is no Excel software. So in this video, we are going to discuss that how to insert these rows and columns and we'll discuss about some more important things about these rows and columns. So hey guys, welcome back to Marketing Fundas Global. This is the fourth video in this full MS Excel course and in this video we are going to show you how to insert rows and columns in MS Excel. So let's get into the video without any further ado. So guys, as you can see right now I am in my Excel software and this is the dummy data which you are able to see here. So yeah, I was talking that this is the dummy data which you are able to see here. So that I can show you how to add or how to insert rows and columns and some of the other factors about rows and columns right now first of all let's start with the column okay so let's say you want to add a column here right but you don't have any space here so how would you able to insert one more column here for that you just have to go to this wordings here column a column b column c so you have to uh, go to the column which or wherever you want to add for example i want to add a column here okay so i just go to this b column and press right click and here i'll be able to see insert and as you can see column is added here okay now for example i want to add here so just right click insert and the column will be added here, right or example let me undo this and undo this user just have to press control z that you can go back your uh, the previous right now suppose i want to add row here so for that you just have to do the same thing go to the row and press right and go to insert and you'll be able to insert one row here for example i want to add here so select the seventh row and insert and you'll be able to see a row between six and eight there's a seventh row right well, let's suppose you have just selected this cell for example i selected this cell now i want to insert something maybe a row or a column and i press uh, right click here and click on insert so excel software is so smart that it will automatically ask that what you want you want to add an entire row add an entire column or you just want to shift the right uh, shift the cell to right or to down right so for example i want to add an entire row so just click on this and press ok it will add an entire row here now for example i have selected this cell right this one and i have clicked on insert now i want to shift this cell to right or down let's say i click on down and press ok it will be shifted to the down as you can see right so that's how you can add uh, columns or rows in your excel sheet now there's one option merge and center right for example let me add one row here so that i can show you insert yeah so this is a row for example i want to add a headline here for this uh, particular sheet right for this whole data for example i write here demo data for practice right as you can see it is not looking like a heading at all it should be in the middle and the size should be a little bit big right but the size we can increase from here like this but it will be not in the uh, middle or you can see these cells are intersecting these uh, particular lines right so for that you just have to select this like how long you want to merge the cells uh, let me click again right like this so i want to merge all these cells and want to uh, center the text right so i just have to press on this and it will be merged and center now if i want i can change the color as well of the text and the background as well like this right there are some more options as well merge across if i click on this uh, wait i have to select the things which will be get merged but i don't have extra space here so let's say i've just selected this now i want to merge across so it will be merged all the rows right and few more options are here let me show you if i click we got few more options merge cells unmerge cells if you want to unmerge the uh, cells you can do this as well right so this was so this was it in this video it was a small video just to show you how you can uh, add rows and columns in your sheets and some extra details about your rows and columns right 
because rows and columns are one of one of the main factor are the only main factor which makes your excel software a proper excel software right that's why i have created this video i hope you like this video i hope you understood each and everything if you still have any question or query please comment down below i'll answer those questions in the comment section itself and if you like the video please hit that subscribe and like button we'll meet you in the next video till then bye bye